stem and leaf plots. A stem and leaf plot shows a large amount of data in a clear way by listing it in order of place value. A stem and leaf plot is generally used when data has multi-digit numbers. In this kind of plot, the ones digit of each number in the data is separated from the other digits. The plot has two columns. The first column, called the stem, lists all of the digits in the tens place and beyond in order. A vertical line divides the stem from the leaves, the second column. This second column shows the ones place of each number in the data also in order. Let's say I have a garden with some apple trees. I count the apples on each tree and write down the following data. In this case, I can use the digits in the tens place of each number, 3, 4, and 5, to make my categories or stems. Then, I can fill in the leaves with the last digit of each number. Let's start at the beginning of the list. The first number is 34. Since the first digit is 3, this number will be recorded on the first stem, or the first row of my plot. The digit 3 is already on the stem, so I will put the 4 on the leaf, like this. Next, I'll place 55 on the 5 stem. Next, I'll add 36 to the 3 stem. My next number is 32. This should go on the 3 stem. But because we want to keep these numbers in order, and 32 is smaller than 34 or 36, the 2 will go to the left of the 4 and the 6, like this. And continuing in this way, I fill in the rest of the plot. Let's practice making another stem and leaf plot. A teacher writes down her students' test scores. Make a stem and leaf plot of these scores. The stems include the digits 6, 8, and 9, since the scores range from 67 to 97. We create the plot with these stems and put each score into the leaf column. And continuing in this way, I fill in the rest of the plot. Let's practice with one last example. Look at the plot below. Ages of people in the park. How old is the youngest person in the park? The stems in a stem and leaf plot are always in order from least to greatest as are the leaves on each stem. So let's look at the first leaf on the first stem. The stem is 1 and the leaf is 2, so the age of this person is 12. If you check any other age this way, you'll see that it is higher than 12. How many 36-year-olds are in the park? Look at the third stem, representing people whose ages begin with 3. There are two 6 leaves, so there are two 36-year-olds in the park. 
How many people in the park are in their 40s? There are two leaves on the four stem, so there are two people in their 40s in the park. Let's recall what you have learned so far.